Welcome to Toronto in the final home game of the regular season for the Argos looking to stay perfect here at BMO Field and welcoming in the Ottawa Red Blacks. This game is underway. The Argos won the toss and they deferred and it comes down on the return Tobias Harris for the Ottawa Red Blacks. Getting it up across the 32 and a 20 yard return for Harris. Point out Mason Pierce in the secondary there. For a touchdown Ottawa for an Ottawa team that failed to score a point in the first three quarters of back to back games against the Alouettes most recently. Seven rushing touchdowns this season. Do I hear eight? Second and third effort. There's the signal. Touchdown Toronto. Cameron Dukes comes on for a play in the product of Lindsey Wilson in Kentucky. Yeah. Argos making no effort to hide what they're doing on this one. Santos Knox comes over the top. The Duke's able to avoid the shot, keep his feet. Reps that he got just a few in Winnipeg a couple of weeks ago before his feet the point out. Looking to take the lead again. Devontae Williams bounces off a tackle and Walsh is into the end zone untouched. Point after by the ex tie cat Michael Domagala. Gets the ball again and into the end zone for the Argo touchdown. His second in the CFL had one last week against Edmonton. Deontay McMahon. McMahon once again in the backfield here. You're going to see his quickness. Little outside in move to freeze the defender. Deontay McMahon who Played his first CFL game against the Alouettes the night they clinched four weeks ago. Morris Beatty puts it through. Both uh, Harris is on the six. He'll let give him the night off. He got a little hobbled we saw against Edmonton last week. He wanted to stay in the game, talk to his coach into that. Here's Tobias Harris on a big return. Across midfield and still going. Jamie Harry can't catch him. Tobias Harris for his first touchdown return in the CFL. 9 of 31 this season. He's only missed two. We'll call that 30 for 32 for Beatty. Michael Domagella. 30 of 32 on the season. Second only to Sean White in field goal percentage. And he stays remarkably consistent. Gets that through, and it's a four point game. So this would be about a 22 yard attempt for Boris Beatty to go three for three in the field goal department on the night. He just took out his slop wedge and had no trouble with that one. So it's Domagala. And he puts another one through. Hey, he's trying the field goal. And he's only tried, he's one for 150 plus this season for a guy that used to dine out on long field goal tries. And so here we go, just his second attempt. More than 50 yards, and he puts it through. Late third quarter. Argos down a point. Chad Kelly still in, and he's chucking it. Deep touchdown. Who else? Kelly to Devaris Daniels. Devaris Daniels going right down the rails. Two defenders on him. Chad Kelly doesn't care. The pass couldn't be any more perfect, but. It's how relaxed Daniels is as he reels that football in. For two, Kelly takes off. He gets hit, taken down, but not before he gets in. This one, much, much shorter. It'll be put down about 21 out. Make it five for five. Get a 10 point lead. Great through it goes. Big part of that victory over the Bombers last year. But we wondered how they would face the challenge of playing these games that don't matter in the standings. And three and one of those is Kelly. Shake some hands with the Red Blacks as the Argos do win again. And they do indeed stay perfect at BMO and a perfect home record.